Hold on, you butts, and prepare for an awesome video. Deadman55 here. Today we're taking a look at the new Holland T8 320 tractor. And you can see the engine. Oh my god. We got a fuel and a hydraulic tank. Nice ladder up to the vehicle. Got a nice toolbox. The grill looks very nice. As well as the side there. Yeah, get a little air intake over here, as well as the uh, exhaust pipe. Got the New Holland logo right there. Front attacher and PTO. Back attacher, PTO. The little ladder over here. The detailing on the on the. Exhaust pipe. I forgot about that for a second, what that word was called. Here's the interior. It's a dark gray and black interior. Black being the floor and the steering wheel. On the front console there, you got some air, air thingies, <laughs> air thingies. No, uh, air vents, various controls. Got your climate control back there, your radio up there. Full surround sound speakers. For your, so you can go rocking out on the field while you're on the field. Anyway, you got some interior lights that do not work. Some storage up there. Another air vent. A nice leather seat. Looks pretty cool. Passenger gets a nice sizable seat. You get a, some... Some, 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 some. Seat belt for the driver. Some cup holders. Storage, more storage. And yeah. And some cigarette ports for those cigarette chargers. And you do get, for your, with your pedal cluster, a uh, cruise control pedal, which is the orange one. I think, I'm pretty sure that's a cruise control pedal. I could be wrong. If any of you know your tractors and you know what that is. Let me know. I kind of know tractors, but I don't know what that orange pedal is. Or I just can't remember. Pretty sure it's a cruise comp cruise pedal, though. It has a nice little white thing up top. And a little step right there so you can check on the engine. And, yeah. The interior. So, the lights. Signal lights are still pretty much in the same spot. A nice warning triangle. Wonder what tractor that's from. <laughs> the Magnum. <laughs> and get the beacon lights that work very well. Also, the mirrors work really well too. So here we go, starting the tractor. Now this definitely has a Cummins engine in it, but just the way it sounds. So 15 down down the hill, even on the backup speed is actually 14, which is very cool. 53 kilometers is the max speed we can go with this tractor. And I do believe there's a reverse light. Yes, there is. Tractor is fairly loud. Oh yeah, and you get a monitor. 53 down the hill. That's pretty cool. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. It's too bad you can't actually push vehicles around. That's kind of sad. Oh! I'm gonna take a look at the uh, um, 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 turn radius. Turn radius is, is alright. For a tractor this size. And, what you can do with this tractor, which you can do with the Magnum, pretty much. So, let's see where the Magnum is. The Magnum's right there. So, they are very, very similar. 
So we got the T8, 320 engine, 380, 435. That's all the engines we can get. So wheel setup is standard, wheel weights, wide tires, crawler track, which the Magnum has. So this tractor is pretty much a Magnum clone, twin wheels, rear twin wheels, and standard. It's kind of weird that uh, they would clone their tractors pretty much. Even though it's not exact exact the same, there's a lot that's the same. It's a little disappointing when... Uh, yeah, but I guess that's how it is in the real world, so... Pretty much, it's it's the Magnum with a different hood design and different color, but yeah, it's pretty much it for the New Holland T8. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And there's a bell icon beside the subscribe button. Click that to be notified when I upload a new video. And Thank you guys for watching and I will see you next time.